30 minutes. Your time starts now. Good luck, boys. Eagle Huck, got your buddy. Least I can do for help me out. <laughs> this is gonna be interesting, ain't it? What do you think they're gonna do? Well, honestly, two of them ain't got much to build on. But you can mask a lot of horrible liquor with a lot of fruit. The other two can't do nothing but go up. But unfortunately, Huck's up there at the top. He could stumble. Going in the final round, you know, my liquor to me was perfect. It was a little bit high proof, but I knew I had the taste, and I knew that all I was going to do was just tweak it down just a little bit. Now, Howard over there, I don't know what in the world he's doing. He got a coffee filter. He's getting them sea monkeys out. So he's going to try to clear it up instead of dirty it up. Well, unfortunately, it won't take that little bit of tinge out of it. It'll it get them floaties out there. Bye-bye, sea monkeys. Rags on fire. Burners on fire. <laughs> Throw <laughs> some <laughs> liquor on it. <laughs> yeah. I think Kelly's concentrating on pineapple, because he's putting more pineapple. He's got cans of pineapple over here. I kind of see this as a challenge to myself to see what I can do with pineapple. I don't know if it's even something that can be distilled into something good. Well, maybe it'll drown out them raspberries or whatever it was. Or the damn scorched tennis shoe or whatever it was in that. That's about enough out of you, Digger. Well, Kelly, we can only come up from here, old buddy, like they said. We already down below dirt. Well, look at here. Huck may not have made it but 15 minutes. I like the taste of it, so I just proofed it down a little bit. You just tempered it down a little bit. It's all done. Let it ride. Howard, me and Tim's done come to a conclusion. At least Tim says he's come to a conclusion. If you win, he taught you everything you know. If you lose, he says, I taught you everything you know. I'm going to go with that storyline. Don't you worry, old buddy. I got you back, Tim. It's damn tickles fault. One minute, you better be figuring it out. That's like, that's like a champagne bucket at this point. It was so hot, it melted the ice. Just in the nick of time. Ooh, damn. Five seconds to spare. Chase on out after hook. I'm not even sure what that is, but there's three different jaws on the table. Tammy, we ain't going to get no decision if we don't get some liquor in our bellies. It's got to be Howard. I see a little debris in here. Looks like might be some apple. That's OK. Almost like a licorice. Yeah. I ain't mad at your flavor. Well, he got some liquor in there. That heat on it? I think it's that vanilla. Ain't it funny how vanilla, if you add it after the fact, will smooth something. But if you throw it in that bumper, she'll spice it right on up. Better shake that up good, Tim. That pineapple or whatever it is on the top of it. Well, if you go that way, it goes to, to that end. If you go this well, way, it goes to that end. Well, that's because it floats. I think Kelly was trying so hard and grasping at so many straws, it just it just went south on it. Now, as far as flavor, I can taste some pineapple, but I don't taste no darn liquor. Now, as I get closer to the bottom of that jaw, that this little sipper, it's like the liquor's staying at the bottom. It's not mixing quite right. Well, it's hiding. Yeah. <laughs> it don't want to be. It don't want to be in there. It's almost like an ice cream topping. Yeah. You know, you had a good Sunday and just pour it on top. It is an improvement. It is most definitely an improvement. We might need that to rinse the taste out of our mouth with them other two. He just gave yeah. us another clear joint. He tempered it down with backings, with tails. All so right. that's even more flavor. Thing about it is, Howard and Kelly only had one way to go All up, right. but when you're already good, you can go down. Ooh, that does have a nice nose on it. Oh, that's nice. All right. I had high hopes, but now uh, Huck, I think, might have moved up enough. But boy, that bit of fire that was in, it's gone. And that's good liquor. But you could build a nice cocktail out of, out of that. Just had a nice cube. That hit me right in the crease. Well, that one's good. Well, boys, it looks to be like we're in agreement. All right, go get them. All right, fellas. Um... Let me start off with saying, there was definitely improvements made when 
y'all flavored y'all's liquors up. Start out with you, Kelly. Kelly, your jaw seems to be changing <laughs> as time goes on. I'm not for sure what you put in that jaw, but as long as it sits there, the more it changes. It's well, still I, cooking. You know, you did improve somewhat of what you had. You did change the profile. And the color. Uh, and the color, <laughs> and, and I don't know where you was going, but you was going. <laughs> And it's still going. <laughs> the taste profile is way better, but the appearance of it sucks. What is this slime in this jar? Well, let's see. They was sugar, and they may have been a jar of mayonnaise and some butter, and that is OK. Enough said. Up. You did the least amount to yours, but you took what we told you was a little bit wrong with it, and, well, you improved upon it. You just brought it down to the perfect temperature. You can pull it right out of a cooler ice and drink it. That's all it needs, or pour it over an ice cube. Great job. How a tremendous improvement. I mean, it's got a few floaters, but it's more like solids. Before, it had little fishes, like, moving around in there. I filtered them out the best I could with yeah. a coffee filter. I mean, you did a great job. It almost looks like a, a cocktail, a punch. And uh, I think put it on ice, you could just drink it straight out of the jar. Proud of you. Tickle said he taught you everything you know. <laughs> oh, hell, I know where this is going, then. <laughs> <laughs> you came from behind better than anybody in this flight. It's still a little bit fierce in there in a place or two. Got a little bit too much cinnamon and some other spice. I don't know what that is. I we, think it's that vanilla. I really it, think, yeah, I, 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 think I, I think vanilla hit a little vanilla too Vanilla extract, if you think you're not using enough, you're probably using too much. Exactly. That's the kind of deal it is. Yeah. So that being said, you improved tremendously. Thank you for that. This is one of the finest challenges that we've been part of. Hell, kudos to you. Well, thanks for having us. All three of y'all are great guys. All three of you is great together. I'm gonna just make it official. Who's gonna take that big roll of copper home? Huh? You the main. Congratulations, Congratulations big guy. Huck. Good we job. knew you had it all the time, didn't you? Yeah. <laughs> I tried to help you. Hey, y'all did, you did a great job. I moved these, these boys down all three rounds, you know. I kicked her butt as a new master distiller in town. Here you go, huh? Don't spend all that copper in one place. That's right. Bust it up into pennies. Ah, now that's a hell of a trophy, on it. Let me just touch it since I'll never own it. <laughs> <laughs> well, oh, mighty. I'll tell you what. Uh-oh. I've got two rolls at home. You was wanting this, here. You ain't got to give that to me, old buddy. There you go. There you go, Howard. <laughs> <laughs>